The Choices I Make by Michael Gordon, illustrated by Max Laren. When Josh got home from preschool, he just wanted to play with his favorite toy. He'd thought about it all day, but when he looked, it wasn't where he thought it should be. He searched all over until he found it with Emily. That's my toy, sister! You stole it! An upset Josh cried. Emily looked shocked by his words. Her mouth opened wide. I borrowed it! I'm sorry! There's no need to be mad! She felt bad that she'd upset him. Her face looked so sad. Dad rushed up the stairs after he'd heard Josh shout out. He said, Josh, what on earth is all the noise about? When Dad heard the story, he looked at Josh and said, Son, nothing is ever gained from losing your head. Did shouting make you feel better or worse, Josh? asked Dad. It seems you've made yourself feel worse and made Emily sad. Calm yourself down by counting backwards from ten in your head. Rather than yelling, kindly ask for your toy back instead. Josh thought about the event. After listening to Dad, he decided to stop and think next time before getting mad. Emily gave Josh his toy, and as he walked off to play, he thought he'd feel better by dealing with upset this way. Mom was making Emily's birthday cake later that week. Josh got very excited after sneaking a peek. He licked his lips after he saw it and thought it looked nice. He wanted so much to reach out and grab a huge slice. He thought about eating it, then about what Emily might say. If there was no cake at her party, she'd have a sad birthday. Josh didn't want to upset his sister, so decided to wait. He wanted to make sure Emily's party would be great. The next morning, Josh's friends came over for the day. They brought over a board game that they all wanted to play. It was a very close finish. Josh tried hard but didn't win. He hated losing games. He felt his anger begin. He wanted to throw the board into the air and stomp away, but he knew if he did that, he would ruin everyone's day. So he breathed slowly and deeply until the anger was gone. Then he said, Well done guys, good job, let's get a new game on. Later at the store, Josh and Mom were standing in a queue. Josh wanted candy but Mom said no, and his temper grew. Please Mom, I really want candy, a frustrated Josh said. Mom repeated, no. Josh got more upset, his face turning red. He felt so angry and hot, he wanted to scream and shout. But he did what he knew would let the anger quietly out. He closed his eyes and counted slowly from 10 to 1 in his head. He didn't get candy, but he got to feel proud of himself instead. The end.